Hello guys, so little update on my EasyRef add-on. Uh, this add-on allows you to uh, add reference in camera and you will see uh, this, this is really nice. So I will select something or not. I will click on add camera. I will select uh, one picture or several pictures and I will have this. So as you can see, I have all my pictures here and I have my camera here. Uh, so you can turn around your selection or you can click here and uh, make uh, the, uh, the zoom like this and click again and uh, zoom out like this. So like this, you will not see the camera border and uh, if you don't care about this, uh, you can keep uh, the, uh, the tool uh, like it was with the camera border. So right now I can click on edit reference and I will move with it grab. I'm, I am in the model here. So as you can see, there is some options to move to uh, with G, to scale with S, to rotate with R, to uh, change the opacity with W, like this, to flip horizontally with X and vertically with C. So as you can see, this is pretty nice. I can do this, I can too to, to fast etc etc and uh, I will exit the model like, like this and now I can work with some references in my uh, my viewport like this and uh, this is pretty nice so imagine uh, you have some uh, you are sculpting uh, an object and you have some uh, some reference here so you can work in full screen no need to add some other uh, some other view and you can of course uh, edit the reference like this and uh, move it uh, if you want uh, like this and make uh, make whatever you want uh, with your reference so this is really nice you can in the models delete some references like this and you can add other reference outside the model this time with plus select and that's it and now you are directly in the model you can edit your your picture and exit the model and that done this is uh, this is okay you have your reference and this is nice uh, if you are a model with a specific reference uh, in a, in, a, in a specific view you can add another reference image for example i will add uh, this one Hop. you can go in the uh, edit ref you can place your reference you can play with the opacity and you can exit the uh, the uh, the model you can place your object if you want like this if you are okay with this if you want you can lock the camera and like this you will not be able to move to rotate etc and you will be able to switch to uh, the camera uh, to all the camera you have like this just uh, click on the camera and this is nice for example if you press shift and click you will rename your camera uh, i will name it a dog I will click on OK and that's it. I have my new camera dog and with my uh, empty image here. I can also add another picture if I, uh, if I want. I will do this. I will move it like this. And as you can see, this is pretty, pretty nice. You can uh, on, uh, add another camera, for example. Uh, I will select uh, this one. I will move where I want. I will place my... Uh, my uh, reference, I will exit. I will lock my camera. Uh, if you have only one reference, you will be able directly to uh, to edit it or to uh, change the uh, the picture for for another picture if you want, like this. So this is uh, this is really useful. Um, uh, you can. If you, if you lock the camera, you will be able to add annotation and you will not be able to move. So uh, this tool will uh, allow you to add annotation on your camera and uh, to make something uh, like this, uh, blah, 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 blah. On fait ça, clac, 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 clac. You can add, hop, I will press space. You can add uh, some layers here, just, uh, yep, do this and uh, boom, 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 blah, blah. Et voilà. So as you can see, this is uh, this is really nice, and those uh, grease pencil are only on this camera. If you select the other view, you will not have the grease pencil, and you will be able to uh, to remove it if you want, etc., etc. I'll add an option to remove it, but right now this is just this. Okay. If you pre if you uh, just uh, click another time to be you have to click another time to place uh, the cursor correctly, and uh, you will be able to edit like this. I will do this, etc., etc. And if I go outside, as you can see, there is no grease pencil, but there is a, the grease pencil is on my camera.
I can go here, I can click on uh, add annotation, and I can uh, do whatever I want on this one. Up. Voilà. And uh, go uh, on another one, and that's it. So the grease, pen the grease pencil annotation is only for uh, locked cam. Like this, uh, you are sure your uh, your uh, fin, your uh, annotation uh, don't move because if I do this, as you can see, I will lose everything. So I will have to uh, to remove, to lock, and to make another annotation like this. So that's it. So as you can see, that can be really, really, really useful, and you can work uh, on your project. You can uh, uh, share it with your uh, boss, and uh, he can uh, add uh, references. He can add annotation. Uh, I don't. I I want this, for example. Uh, I will do this. I want this uh, more like this, uh, etc., etc. I can edit this. I can make. Uh, I want my person, my character like this. I'm too good at drawing, <laughs> etc. Et and uh, if I go here, I have this one, this one, this one. So this is um, this is really nice. Zero to uh, exit, and as you can see, I still have my uh, my object, and this is nice. Nice. I can go here, here, here. So that's it. It's not finished. I will make uh, some. Uh, for example, I will add. Uh, uh, X to remove the uh, the uh, grease pencil, uh, and I will add some other options. So I hope you like it, and see you later.